230 volt square wave inverter. Inverter is an electrical device that converts DC power into AC power. Our household inverters mainly have two parts, battery charging circuit and inverter circuit. Battery charging circuit charges the battery when power is available and the inverter circuit convert the DC power stored in the battery to AC power whenever needed. In this project, we will learn how to convert a 9 volt DC into 230 volt AC using 4047 IC. These are the components which are needed in this project. 4047 IC, 14 pin IC base, 2, 100 ohm resistors, 2, 1 kilo ohm resistors, 18 kilo ohm resistor, 2, IRFZ44, N channel MOSFET, 200 nanofarad ceramic capacitor, 1 red LED, 909 center tap transformer, 9 volt battery, PP3 battery connector, on off, rocker switch, 1 0 PCB, 4 screw with nuts, and 4 plastic spacers. Before making the project, we will understand its circuit diagram. This is a 9 volt battery to power up the circuit. This is an on off switch which is used to start or stop the project. This is a power supply indication LED. This is a current limiting resistor to protect the LED from high current and voltage. 4047 IC is a 14 pin IC. It continuously gives high and low pulse at its output pins 10 and 11. When pin 10 is high, pin 11 is low, and when pin 10 is low, then pin 11 is high. We have connected a resistor and N channel MOSFET at both the output pins. So at a time, one MOSFET will be on, another one will be off. MOSFET is a type of transistor. It works like a digital switch. It is used to carry high current and voltage. It has three terminals, drain, source and gate gate pin of mosfet is connected with the output pin of ic source terminal of mosfet is connected with the ground drain terminal of the mosfet is connected with the transformer a center tap transformer is used to convert 9 volt ac into 230 volt ac two wires of primary side of the center tap transformer are connected with the drain terminal of mosfet and middle wire of the transformer is connected with a 9 volt supply. So whenever any MOSFET will turn on, it will connect the transformer's wire with the ground supply. At a time, one wire of the transformer will be connected with the ground supply, and the middle wire will always connect it with the 9 volt supply. So an alternating current will flow at transformer's primary. Transformer will step up this 9 volt AC and give 230 volt AC at its secondary side. Resistor and capacitor are used with IC4047 to make its output switch at 50 Hz frequency. These components will be used to make the circuit. First of all, we will make a PCB base and for that, we will take a zero PCB and make a hole at each of its corner. Now, we will insert a 1 inch screw inside the hole. Now we will take a plastic spacer and then we will use a nut to lock the spacer. Now our PCB base is ready. To switch on or off our project we will use an on off switch. We need to make a big hole to fit this switch on the PCB. Use a permanent marker to make the outline on the PCB. Use the tweezer to make the hole in the PCB. Use the cutter to cut the plastic. Now insert the switch inside the hole. Now we will solder the 1 kilo ohm current limiting resistor. This resistor will protect the LED from high voltage and current. Now we will solder the power indication LED on the PCB. Now we will solder the 14 pin IC base on the PCB.
Now we will solder the 18 kilo ohm resistor on the PCB. Connect any one terminal of the resistor with pin number 2 of IC base. Now we will connect the 1 kilo ohm resistor. Connect any one terminal of 1 kilo ohm resistor with the 18 kilo ohm resistor and second terminal with pin number 3 of IC base. Connect pin number 4, 5, 6 and 14 with positive power supply. Connect pin number 7, 8, 9, and 12, with ground power supply. Now we will solder the MOSFETs. MOSFET has three pins. First pin is called gate. Second pin is drain, and third pin is source. Connect a 100 ohm resistor between the gate terminal of one MOSFET and pin number 10 of IC base. Connect another 100 ohm resistor between the second MOSFET and pin number 11 of IC base. Connect the source terminal of both the MOSFETs with the ground power supply. Now connect 200 nano fed ceramic capacitor between pin number 1 and 3 of IC base. Now we will solder the PP3 battery connector. Connect the red wire with the positive terminal and black wire with the negative terminal in the circuit. Now we will take a center tape transformer. It has two wires at its one side and three wires at another side. Connect the two wires of one side with a bulb holder. Now connect the three wires with the PCB. Connect the middle wire with 9 volt supply and other wires with the drain terminal of the MOSFET. Now plug the IC on the IC base and check its functioning. Our circuit is working perfectly. I hope you enjoyed the video and learned something from it. For any help or to clear your doubts regarding your project, you can contact us on our student care number 7007957715. To buy the items used in this project, you can visit our website www.eraltech.com. You can give us the orders on WhatsApp also. Thank you so much.